Hi, it's Terry. I'm uh, going to show you how to make a sound editing with uh, Audacity. What I have here is a preloaded program. Uh, I uploaded a or uploaded a September 30th sermon. Uh, what you want, to, if you want to bring this up, just start Audacity and uh, bring in this file. So once this file is up, to edit. You, uh, what you want to do is, on, this is me, I'm pressing on the left mouse key, and that highlights whatever you want to do, right? So I'm going to go back to the beginning and do whatever, um, I'm slide this far back to beginning. Okay, so let's say I wanted to highlight this part right here. I want, let's say I want to delete this, so I could go File, uh, Edit right here, then we want to go to remove audio and delete or cut. We want to do delete. So we're going to go ahead and delete. Now I'll play the audio back. Okay, let's say we wanted that out and we're going to delete it again. This time I'm just hitting delete key on my keyboard. And let's say you made a mistake. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Just go to undelete. And there's several, you can keep going back and forth in this undelete until you're back to the beginning where you started. Uh, so let's just do, listen to this part right here. That's going to, okay, okay, here we go. I decided I don't want that. I'm going to go ahead and highlight and delete with my delete key. Then I want to save as, so I'll save the project as September 30th, 2012 in Audacity. See, it's in the Audacity project. Uh, save that. So it only takes a few seconds to save an Audacity. Let's say I'm all done now and I want to make an MP3. You have to go to File right up here to Export and it will should come up MP3 files to be automatic. Uh, there's an option key. You don't really have to mess with that. It's already set where I want it but it's 128K which is C CD quality. Then you want just hit Save button all right, and of course I already have one, so I'm just going to I'm going to replace it. But it'll bring up this metadata, and this is um, something you want to fill in too. So you want the artist here and the sermon name here, and the rest you can just fill in. Uh, you can see it's just kind of self-explanatory. And you hit OK. Once you hit OK, then Audacity is going to start. You'll see it's extracting the file at 128K. So this uh, is encoding it back into MP3. And once it's done encoding, then um, I'll show you what you can do next. It's going to be that's going to be all you have to do at this point to edit a file. So once it's done, you're done, and you just if you want to just remember where you, you saved your file. Uh, it's going to be in the in that directory. Um, that's all you have to do and the next step will show how to upload that using FTPs and uh, FileZilla. That's it for this video. If you have any questions just check on the links of the video. I'll be glad to answer them.